Today we're going to be taking a look at part number DL10965. This is the Denton Lanson Worm Gear Hand Winch with a hex drive when it comes to the handle as well as a split reel design for two cables. Now this winch is going to have a capacity of 1500 pounds. It's designed for safe controlled movement of loads. The winch is going to stop turning whenever cranking stops. There's no freewheel mode with this winch. There's no mechanism required to stop the gear movement and there's no minimum load required. It's going to have the split drum design that's going to allow pull from opposite directions. The hand winch eases loading of your cargo. It's going to feature the laminated um, high carbon steel gears. Uh, these are going to be heat treated for a longer life. You're also going to have the heavy gauge embossed steel base for extra strength and support. The bearings on the drive shaft are going to be permanently lubricated and maintenance free. The split reel is going to allow operation of two lines for greater versatility. It does include the handle. You can see how that easily detaches. It kind of has that um, socket style or what's known as a hex drive. So you can also use a heavy duty variable speed drill bit with a half inch shaft and 5 8 inch socket and that's going to help speed up operation. This product is going to feature a powder coated copper bronze finish and it's going to be completely made here in the USA. Now the handle length, if we take a measurement of that, simply measuring from the center of the handle to the center of where it mounts, that's going to give us a measurement of right at 7 inches. The winch is going to have a gear ratio of 30 to 1. What that means is for every 30 full turns of our handle, the gear or the drum is going to complete one full rotation. Now it is pre-lubricated, so you will want to go ahead and make sure that gear spins a couple times. It's going to spread out that lubrication and uh, making sure everything is going to be functioning the way that it uh, should be or the way that it's designed to be for when you're ready to use it. The drum hub diameter on this unit, unit is going to measure an inch and a half. When it comes to the drum storage, if you're going to use a quarter inch cable, you're going to have up to 43 feet in length which is going to give you 21 and a half feet per side. If you're using a cable with a 3 16th of an inch uh, diameter to it, you're going to be allowed 81 feet um, in length total, and that would mean 40 and a half feet per side. Um, again, this has a capacity of 1,500 pounds. We're going to flip it over and take a measurement of the base. This base is going to give us a measurement of five and a half inches long. by four and three quarter inches wide. We're going to take some measurements of just the winch. It's going to give us a height of six inches. That's without the handle installed. With the handle installed, the measurement to this point right here is going to be about seven and one quarter and the measurement to the top of the handle that's going to measure twelve and a half inches. Now the actual winch measuring from edge to edge that's going to give us a measurement of about seven and one quarter of an inch going that direction and edge to edge go in this direction, just measuring from the out uh, most part, the outermost part of the hardware on each side. That's going to give us a measurement of about five and three quarters of an inch. Now here on the bottom, you can see that we have the different bolt patterns. Taking a measurement center on center, the distance between these two holes, that's going to measure about two and five eighths of an inch. And then the distance that we have between these two holes, center on center, the two perfectly round holes, it's going to measure about one inch. These two holes are going to have a separation of, looks to be about two and five eighths of an inch. And then that means that this one would be about three and five eighths of an inch center on center. Go ahead and spin this a couple times, that way you can see how smooth the operation is. 
Again, it's going to have a gear ratio of 30 to 1. That's going to do it for our review of part number DL10965. This is the Dutton Lanson Worm Gear hand winch with a hex drive and split reel for two cables.